moving on to the Sweet 16 and on to our BMW Tennis Channel desk. What an intro. <laughs> you're welcome. That's that what you amazing. get when you're, the, when you're the top ranked American in the world, Jess, oh and you gosh. just keep on winning. Yeah, yeah. No, it was a great match. It was obviously a tough, tough battle out there today. Um, I first match during the day as well. Like I played Georgie at night, which I felt like was complete opposite of the conditions and conditions here are really tough. Like very, I don't know if everyone realizes it. I think all the players realize it, but it's very difficult to gauge like what day is gonna play like. Mm. Like it's just windy, cold, mm. warm, hot. Today was hot. I was like, I, what's going on? Last time I played, it was like 50 degrees. It's crazy. It's just like you never know. It's been wild weather in general in, mm -hmm. in the Southern California area. I mean, it snowed in Manhattan Beach. It's it's, yeah. it's nuts. Uh, we're watching your doubles partner as well play some yeah. singles action. Up a break right now, Coco, right. against Linda Noskova. Mm -hmm. uh, first round, you, you were down a set against Georgie. You came back from that one, and then this one, come back from a set again. What is it in those moments that uh, kind of pushes you to victory? Um, I don't know. I think I've just been starting off very slow, to be honest. I don't know why. Um, I feel like I've been starting off slow, and then I, I start playing better at the end of the first set. So I feel good going into the second, but I'm like, ugh, like, again, like, I'm down, like, you know, 3-0 or something, like, over a break. And I'm just, like, kind of annoyed at myself a little bit. But then I think, I don't know, maybe it's nerves or I'm not sure. But then it kind of goes away, and I feel like I can start playing my game. And uh, today same thing happened I, I started playing better um third set though still went down an early break so had to fight my way back but yeah i, I just i don't know it feels like slow starts lately uh, jess how did you feel with the with the rhythm of the match it seemed like she was in control for a large part of it in, in pockets and then as you mentioned she was up in the third set at the end of the day you ended up winning one more point than her it was that's really? how close the match was wow. 106 points to 105. So did good. you did you feel like you were you were chasing for a large portion of the match yeah i mean the second set i felt like i was more in control um but then the, i feel like the wind started to blow pretty good on the one side so it was tough it was you know, you try to hold on the side with the with the wind always, and then the side against the wind was important to hold as well because of it was just tougher to win the point. So then the one side we kept breaking with the wind. So it was just weird. Like it was one of those where I could feel like, okay, if I could just sneak out a break on this side and make sure I just keep holding, I felt like I was going to be okay. But um, yeah, the third set, the momentum was it, it like you said, it's one point. Like I felt like one point could have switched either way. Um, luckily, it was in my favor, but. Um, yeah, I, I guess I, I had the momentum at the end. That's all that matters. One of the one of the ongoing things that we've been talking about here on Tennis Channel as we're taking a look at Coco is is, is the beautiful doubles that you guys have played together. Mm -hmm. And and for, we've all felt that it's it's helped both of your singles games so mm -hmm. much as well. Um, There's so many different things that you could you could pick on mm -hmm. that that it's helping. W what do you think it's making the most effect to? I just think like my feel around the court has gotten so much better. Like I remember before, I, I just I wasn't good at like you know, a low slice forehand or a slice drop shot or a lob or, you know, like all those small little intangibles that you kind of pick up playing doubles has gotten way, way better. And now um, now I feel like I, I'm winning points like that. Even the last match point, I went and got a dig with a forehand cross court. And like th those shots, I wasn't really winning points like that maybe a few years ago. So I think playing doubles has definitely, definitely helped in that aspect. And then of course, uh, serve and return and just pressure, more pressure moments, pressure points. Um, Especially me because I take the no ad points. So you, you take a lot. I always take, take the, the no ad point. return. <laughs> That's just the way you know. I have the return from the back. She's at the net with her forehand, so it just makes more sense. But um, I think all those things just they add up, and uh, I think it's helped a lot of the intangibles. Oh, that's, that's fantastic to hear. Obviously, getting to hit with, with such a great player like Coco Goff. And then, you know, the United Cup and, and the other Americans that you've yes. gotten so close to. What, what's going on on the group text right now? What, what's the, the big um, topic? I think not much. I think I... No, it was the other night when it rained. <laughs> Excuse me. And... Francis's court was dry before mine, so I was like giving him crap about it. <laughs> I was like, he doesn't even want to warm up half the time. Like his warm ups are like nothing. I'm like, w what's going on here? Like, why why isn't my court dry? But he's down there hitting, and I'm like, so that, that was the last. You're thing the you're the second United Cup team member to come to this desk and give for Francis me. some grief. Yeah, well, yes, that's yesterday. all we did for the whole trip. Yeah. Yesterday Taylor was making fun of his basketball. Today, oh you, you yeah, him grief for that. Oh, his basketball. Yeah, he was fired up about that. <laughs> I didn't get to watch it. He had a shooting coach and everything. And then he like barely shot. Oh. And he, yeah. He, 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 had, uh, he said two for three tones. Two for three tones. Yeah. Two four for points. Th oh, God, the tones. Yeah, the tones. <laughs>
the tones, like even like uh, I think it was Maddie Keys, her, her trainer Rocket was even yeah. putting in tones in his workouts, like oh, no. workout tones. Like he just like it was just became a whole thing. Everything became a thing. It was so funny. What are tones? I like vibes. 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 Okay. Tones. <laughs> I mean, don't you see his outrageous hash like his hashtags? They they, they are outrageous. Just a kid from Sierra Leone. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> <laughs> Quarterfinal tones or you know Palm Spring tones. I'm like, <laughs> Jess, every t every single time you come to the TC desk, we we have to ask you something dog related because okay. that's one of my million favorite things about you. you. Uh, a lending paw? Mm -hmm. uh, tell us. Uh, yeah. I absolutely love it. So please, please tell tell, oh, tell the audience. Oh yeah. So. Um, so basically, it's just helping all animals. Basically, I prefer dogs mostly, but it's mostly dogs. But uh, the main idea behind it was like people helping dogs, dogs helping people. So a lending paw, and it was to help fund uh, training for service dogs to help people that actually really, really need them, whether it's a veteran or someone with a with a disability. And it's really cool. It's amazing how many great stories come from people that are really struggling in life and, and they have a companion that really helps them. And even actually my coach David has a service dog. His daughter, yeah, his daughter had, uh, I think, diabetes. So when she was younger, he, she, the dog could smell sugar mm. levels, which is amazing. So when she was sleeping at night, like, that's surf dog. So it, it's really cool. It's really cool. And um, I don't know. That's just what I love dogs and helping people. And uh, to see how they help each other is, is really beautiful. So that's I magic. love it. <laughs> dogs are the best. Dogs yeah. are the best. Three, three dog lovers. Right here. Okay, uh, Jess, Absolutely. congratulations <laughs> on the win today. Thank Thanks you. for spending some time with us. Thanks. Hope to see you again soon. Cool. Thanks.